Man, you guys know that video I did with Public Enemy and, I guess, Bernie. Shoot, this is messed up. Uh, I guess Flavor Flav is out of Public Enemy. Because uh, I guess he didn't want to support Bernie Sanders. I love Public Enemy. I dig uh, Chuck D a lot. And it's nothing to diss him, but I'm sorry. Flav is on... I, I think he's wise in not wanting to do that. You know? Um, I think he made a comment about it looking like a fake revolution, and I agree with it. This dude's using all, I mean, it's, he's pandering, man. Pandering, dude. Straight up pandering. I mean, it's obvious. And people are acting like this Bernie Sanders dude is going to do something. He's not. He's totally not going to do anything, especially for black people. Flavor Flav, I mean, people might think that he's crazy, but he knows what's going on, dude. I'm surprised Chuck is, is on board with this guy. I'm really surprised. I forgot to mention in my last video about Killer Mike, too. To be honest, that's what actually got me into wanting to know about Bernie Sanders was Killer Mike. And then I was just like, okay, no, I'm not interested. You know, when I'm, you know, when I found out other things about him that I don't like, things that... A lot of you in black society know Bernie Sanders is not for black reparations. He supported the crime bill. We don't need to be for that dude. He thinks him being a democratic socialist is going to put him on something. No, because it's still at the end of the day, at the end of the, at the end of the at the end of the day, does not cater to our tangibles. Now, if he was a Stokely Carmichael type, maybe, but no. He's not. And he's not trying to be like that. So, shout out to Flavor Flav. Thanks for not believing the hype. 